Aerial Yogis, I'm Camille and welcome back to my Camille Yoga Aerial Yoga channel full of tutorials, full classes of Aerial Yoga, Yin Aerial Yoga and all kinds of stuff. And today we will have a very fun class as today we will learn mini flow uh, which is called revolving flow as we will twirl around a little bit with the silk so more from the flips and tricks series uh, more advanced as you will need more muscle power so if you feel like you're not yet strong enough with your arms just check out uh, here of the video for the especially for the upper body strength full aerial yoga class by the way guys uh, currently uh, there's a sale on my only teacher training just for the autumn uh, you know back to school uh, and also if you use extra discount uh, code YouTube 100 you will get extra 100 euros off of the course uh, so just check it out on my website if you're interested uh, but let's go back to our topic and first of all let's check how uh, the whole flow looks and then continue step by step slowly to get it actually how it's supposed to be because at first it will look a little bit tricky on some part so first just check it through and then let's continue together Okay, so let's start by standing in the front of a silk, narrow silk, and grab it just by the hips, so over your glutes, over your buttocks, and uh, stick it on. Lean into it, but the silk will stay over your, over your, over your glutes, or on, just on top of your glutes, but it won't slide on your uh, waistline, which is very uncomfortable, very not good for the back, to squeeze into that into where with a whole weight so keep it rather where a little bit softer tissues are you know uh, uh, around just through the buttocks and through the hip bones okay so we're lifting putting here just over it not on your waist lower and then lean into it into the back straddle into the star and here just bend your right leg. I will do the mirror here. Yeah? No, maybe I will do the same. Correct. Okay, so now let's practice it. Cut. Okay, so now as you saw the flow, let's learn it together, step by step. So just stand in front of a silk, narrow silk. Uh, and just grab it by the hip bones so note your silk shouldn't be on your waistline like this it will ske squeeze you a lot and it's very not good to put that much pressure on your middle back so a little bit on the more softer areas you know the glutes uh, the glutes and buttocks so on the top actually glutes not in the middle just over them where the hip bones are so just under your waist by the glutes and near the hip bones and then you're holding the silk like this narrowly leaning into it and coming entering the back straddle or in this pose if we are releasing the arms star pose from the star bend your right knee onto the silk hook it and lower your left leg down Grab the silk by looking to your belly and then push your right foot all the way forward so you're hooking through your knee, knee bend and hold the silk over your head and a little bit pull up to enter the dancer pose. So the left silk is just under your armpit, extend your right arm 
as if you're holding a bow and lower uh, bottom leg is bent and the right leg extended okay from here let's continue with that revolving now revolving we lifting our bottom knee up the left knee up then hold both arms onto your left side of the silk and this time uh, left ankle is pressed into the opposite side so the left side just the ankle and then we will turn away I will turn away from you so you're turning backwards and together with this as you see my left elbow is or I'm mirroring you by the way <laughs> my left elbow is already pressing into silk so don't change any position of your arms or shoulders the silk should be just going along your waistline and then we are pulling up twisting away all the way through a little bit back bend and your left le left foot will enter into the silk so from ankle it turns around into the foot so if you're a little bit struggling of course when you do it fast this is actually way easier <laughs> so keep holding the silk over and put your left leg ankle against the silk lift a little bit pull up twist away from me and then your foot should be in the silk now we pressing the left foot forward while taking out the right leg off the silk unraveling let's see and then extending the left leg all the way forward to extend the silk throughout so you see the left uh, sorry the right silk side is just coming through your hip flexors the the groin and the groin and if you're already here then you're leaning back and now the left leg is going not from outside but crossing through forward and hooking through the outside edge of your foot into the silk and then you can release finally <laughs> releasing the arms either here either holding interlacing your fingers note you probably will feel a little bit squeeziness here so we're not staying here forever <laughs> just coming back climb up now we putting the right leg back into the position what we started the dancer pose so lift up bend a little bit your left knee the one that's in the silk and you see there is a gap between the leg and the silk so we want that gap and put the right leg into the gap releasing your left left leg and we coming back into the dancer where we started let let's stop here a little bit in the dancer and do it one more time and then finish the flow okay so from this dancer pose we're doing the revolving again so you're lifting your left knee both hands holding left side put your ankle against press the ankle against your silk a little bit pull up twist revolve around and with the left foot inside the silk take out the right leg unwrap it extend the left lean back hook your right leg from through the outside of the edge and release your arms and inhaling coming back bend a little bit your left knee to go through through your right leg through that gap between the leg and silk release the left leg coming back into the dancer i hope you're nailing this if not if you're struggling a little bit just work by stop the video and just work it on one part okay step by step because uh, it's still quite tough this uh, this flow but once you get it the faster you do it the easier it is and then we're just twisting in a in a fall, forward fold so both legs together we're twisting away again from me so to backwards and releasing your arms or perhaps holding the legs and bringing them closer to your chest and what is left is backward flip so you're taking the edges of the silk the sides of the silk but uh, note the palm the hand position four fingers going 
inwards inside the silk bend your elbows bend your knees and draw your head up bend your elbows even more to pull up into the feet that swing lean back put your uh, draw your left knee through all uh, right leg step down and then we opening into the dancer or even split so there it is uh, let's do it uh, one more time on the other side and as I mentioned before since the slow it's quite advanced just take it easy take it slow perhaps stopping the video in some parts and repeating just one step at a time and then continue with the other step that we could doing okay so let's now do you we will lift now left side left leg so stand up in front of a silk lean back into back straddle either arms out into the star and bending your left leg and hooking onto the silk of left side release your right leg backwards like a pigeon and then walk your arms climb up so hooking all the way through the knee joint of your left leg and we entering first of all the dancer. So now we doing the opposite motion through the left, extending the left leg but bending the right knee, right? In here, in the dancer. And now the revolving, the twisting around, the twirling around. So now I lean back a little bit and lift my right knee, both hands holding the right side of the sill. Now we pressing our right ankle against the silk and as you see my knee is already going on the opposite direction elbow is also showing the direction going through and i'm twisting around the right side of the silk so we twisting and the right foot enters presses into the silk while i'm twisting out and traveling through the left leg pressing the silk even more from my right leg to extend it lean back extend your left leg but crossing through crossing forward or it will be your right side and hook your uh, through the uh, side edge or the outer edge of the foot into the silk and release your arms so the silk should be still for your waistline here and then coming up and hooking your uh, left leg and we're going in between the silk and right leg to hooking in between that the gap release the right foot and we entering again into the dancer pose from the dancer you're putting both your legs together you can cross your ankles and just twist inwards into forward fold either arms release either bring them closer by your hands bringing your legs closer and then backwards flip so just grabbing the silk from inside four fingers knees together and lift your head bend your elbows even more and we entering the seated swing and right knee going through the silk by hooking through the ankles step forward through your left leg and ta-da! <laughs> either dance so or either a split. And uh, just one more time together in fast motion. Uh, let's do uh, this side, okay? So left side, leaning backwards into back, uh, back straddle or star, hooking your left leg into the pigeon, release the back leg, climb up into the dancer, and then lean back. Hook your right ankle and revolve around and twist the other leg. Extend both legs, just the other one hooks through the foot. And hook the foot, go between the gap and the silk, releasing your right leg into the dancer. Twist inwards into forward fold and backwards flip into the seat. And then knee inwards step forward and that's it that's your flow i hope it went well for you if not just take it easy 
and let me know how it, where was your struggle in this in this flow even if you managed to do it all where's the tough part in here so let me know uh, where it feels for you harder where what it was easy and did you like this flow <laughs> So I wish you all the best in your practice and just let me know if you want, if you have some requests for other tutorials or flows you want to learn. Perhaps you saw more flows on my Instagram that you would like to learn. So let me know. You can follow me there at Camille Ge, and uh, also check up all the information about all the things about aerial yoga, my classes, teacher trainings, aerial yoga silk sets or whatever just uh, you would have things on your mind so let me know and uh, other than that as always just do all those little steps subscribe like comment down below as we talked before i would really like to know what you think about this tutorial this flow or what you would like to see in other videos in other tutorials or flips and tricks or perhaps other early yoga classes that I do like full length perhaps Ian with a low hammock and stuff like that other than that see you soon guys bye